And then finally, Nasira with the last question. Many of us children and youth in South Africa feel that because of the pandemic, we are going to be perceived as a lost generation and not able to get jobs. How then can the future for me and the rest of South Africa's children be secure? So that's a beautiful question, and I think you need to, Wayne. We need to get it to, we're to Alex. We need to get it to repeat it again because I think everybody needs to hear what she said. So I think can you just help? Because I think we mustn't lose this beautiful question. Many of us children, many of us children and youth in South Africa feel that because of the pandemic, we are going to be perceived as a lost generation and not able to get jobs. How then can the future for me and the rest of our Africa's children be secure? Okay, so I think you heard that, um, and it's very important uh, that we don't want any child to be part of a lost generation. And we don't want any child to lose out um, of their education or on the opportunities for the future because of COVID-19. And it's our job as South Africans and it's our job as society and it's our job as children and children advocates to make sure that no child loses his or her future uh, because of COVID-19. And we have to make sure as South Africans that no child um, is lost, is a lost generation because of this. So we're going to have to catch up school and we're going to have to make sure that children uh, get food, get their food parcels and we're going to have to make sure that we concentrate on making sure that no child is left behind uh, because of COVID-19. And we all have to promise that as South Africans. And so thank you for that important question. And make it helps us, and it must be our mantra um, going forward that um, there is say no to a lost generation and say no to letting any child be left behind because of COVID-19.